Hey guys, it's Nia. Thank you so much for being here and welcome back for another motivational cleaning video. Today I have an extra special clean with me because I am getting my house in order for Riley's birthday. Tons of cleaning motivation, decluttering and organizing, decorating, and real life house cleaning. Make sure to stay to the end to see how we decorated her playroom as well as her bedroom. It's the ultimate dream for any toddler girl. If you enjoy motivational cleaning videos like this, please give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing before you leave so you never miss out on a future video. Baby, there ain't nobody like you. Today I'm starting off in her playroom because this is the room that needed the most work. I will be decluttering, organizing, and cleaning up her toys. It was time to get rid of things that she no longer played with, especially since she would be getting new toys for her birthday. I also wanted to move things around to fully maximize the space in here, also give the rug a good vacuuming, and just wiping down all of the surfaces. much for all the love and support on my latest video it really means so much to me that you guys took the time out to watch and comment and if this is your first time here thank you so much for clicking on today's video my name is Nia and I'm a working mom who shares real life everyday messes so on my channel I post tons of cleaning and organizational videos and I like to add in easy recipes as well so if you enjoy content like this please consider subscribing. I would love to have you. And also make sure to introduce yourself in the comments so I can personally say hi. I then really wanted to tackle these bins. We basically had just been throwing so many different stuff in there. There was a ton of different crafts that I had printed out that she had done and I really don't think that she's interested in doing them a second time. So that's what you see me adding to the pile of things that I'm going to throw away. And then once I cleared everything out of the bin, then I wanted to just basically put all like-minded things together, like all of her like books and things like that in one bin and then all of her crafts in another.
containers to see if they had dried out because I don't know about you guys, but my toddler loves leaving her Play-Doh all around the house and then it dries out. But if that is the same thing that happens to you, now that I know how to make my own Play-Doh, I will probably not be buying any from the store anymore. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I do have a highlight saved as to how you can make your own DIY Play-Doh. It's a really great craft for any toddler and will keep them active and busy for a while. and taking the bin of toys and putting it under the sewing machine. I feel like it opens up the room a lot more. There seems to be a lot more space, but let me know your thoughts down in the comments. sand for Riley and I'm not going to lie that this is probably one of the biggest purchases I regret because this stuff gets everywhere and even after vacuuming the rug I still was not able to get this stuff out so I'm going in with my totally awesome spray from the Dollar Tree and this was able to get it up out of the carpet. next day and I am putting together her dollhouse that we had got for her. It is super affordable and it's the cutest thing ever. She had such a great time playing with it. I will leave it linked down below as well as the little dolls that I had picked up as well. I won't make it easy for you now. up my time and I don't really break too easily but I'm worth it cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight oh so give me so give me your all I'll take it I'll take it to Mars oh I'll stick like glue inside your mind just watch me break in
and also start like just prepping any little thing for the next day because we were going to be celebrating her birthday and the last thing I wanted to do is also have to clean up the kitchen so I figured if I can get this out of the way it's one less thing I had to worry about. I know that you've been down thinking about him again I know that your heart's been broken You should try and let it go and start being yourself you have a good time but it wasn't until at night where we surprised her with this like new bedding set and everything she was so happy which I will show you guys in just a little bit
day of the party and it turned out to be such a nice day we were able to get outside have Riley go swimming and then my sister also came up and we wanted to celebrate her as well because she was supposed to be getting married this year and have her bridal shower but unfortunately with everything that's going on it had to be canceled and we just wanted to do something really special and nice for her just to let her know that we love her so I'm gonna quickly tidy up my room it was a hot mess and then head over to Riley's room and decorate that and try Try and hide it as best as I can until the end of the night. while she was playing outside because she is definitely a mommy's girl. She will come and find me throughout the entire house. So I only had a little bit of time to quickly clean her room and also decorate and put up her new bedding. Oh, here you are, face to face in this trashy bar. Another glass and I am going places makes me laugh about the irony of everything. I like the way you're thinking I don't really care about the music on the dance floor I don't really mind all the smoke is in the bathroom I don't care at all, baby, you got my attention So you were saying, oh no I don't see the logic of things It's quite a lonely world that we're living in Oh baby, you are something special, I'm sure Everything makes sense when you're next to me
Yeah. 